Hey, what's up guys? I've recently been um, working on my split. I say probably like a month, but it, haven't, it hasn't been consistent. So what I wanted to do is start documenting the process of me learning my split. So usually what I would do is I would, uh, cause I, I, I've always been stiff growing up. I used to stretch like this, my knees and do like this. And you know, it turned out pretty bad for me. You know, cause I, I've been stiff ever since, just I can remember. But now I'm able to do this. And I haven't been able to do that, ever. Ever since, I started doing this probably when I turned 30 or something like that. That's when I took stretching serious and I, you know, start knowing the, the benefits of it, whatever. But um, when I started out doing my split, I think I was like up to here. I think I was up to here. But now, you know, I can get down a little further without any support. So I'm gonna keep it here for a while. You know, take some deep breaths. Probably move around with it. And when you're doing a split, uh, you know, it starts to get painful. You start to get sore. You want to give give it a rest, maybe about three days, three or four days. You want to take a little break. The more you just sit in one position, it, you know, it starts to go down a little bit more. I should have did this barefoot, but yeah. Just want to hold it there. Get these all the way, all the way back. This is a little muscle right here. I do not know the names of these muscles, but there's so many muscles. Uh, this it starts to hurt. Ugh. Yeah, my hamstrings, they always been stiff. My hamstrings has always been stiff growing up. <clears throat> ah, I'm gonna take that break. Then I see uh, sitting like this, or you know, you remember this when you was young, when we were flexible, you're able to do stuff like this, but I, I still can't do it but like this. Oh yeah, I can, a little bit, but not like how I wanna do it. Like my, my back, can't even uh, touch the ground. Get some of this going on. I forgot the name of this stretch right here. But we, when you stretch, you wanna um, you wanna keep those positions for a while. You don't wanna you know hurry up and get up like I just like I just did. You wanna hold it there for a while. I, I was looking at this, uh, I think you called it a contortionist, someone who's like really, really flexible. And she was able to like put her feet all the way up to the back of her head. I just thought that was crazy. Thought that was out of this world. <sighs> when you look at other cultures, like I would say like the, the Buddhists, you know, the, the monks or whatever. Those people are very, very disciplined and very, very, uh, let's get some of this. Ah, and very, very flexible. Those people can hold positions like for hours. And it is, it's very inspiring. It's very inspiring what these people can do. So we're gonna do a little stretching. Oops, I'm gonna take these socks off. Take the socks off, because they start to look funny when they <laughs> rub against the uh, carpet. Uh, 
get this stretching. Get switch. You don't want to bounce neither. I always heard that that was dangerous. Like bouncing the stretch like this. But this tends to like uh, stretch like the back of my uh, hamstrings. Well on the side of my hamstrings. But you want to get all of that stretching in before you go for a second round of, of your split. So. <sighs> I like doing this. This helped me with my uh, kick flips. My ankles are, are bent, you know, disciplined to go do that. Uh, skateboard talk. I like to massage the back of uh, my calves. So, the second round, I'm gonna go, probably do it for maybe 20 seconds. One, two, 10, 19, 20. Let's go up to a minute, 22, 23, 58, 59, 60. Ah, so we're going to relief that. It's good to go like four because it's, uh, it's stretching out different parts of this little bone right here. Ah. Not bone, but the ligaments and tendons that, uh, the ligaments and tendons that surround that bone. So another good stretch is, I don't know what it's called, but you know, it's this one right here. So it's like you're doing, it's like you're doing the split, but uh, you just got your knees bent or whatever. You do that, come around. You want to stretch all, all the ligaments. Stretch it all, stretch it all, stretch it all. Get that good stretching. Uh, st stretching, it helps with your energy during the day. Stretching and water. So we're going to repeat that and we're going to get some more uh, videos uploaded after this just to keep track of the uh, progress so peace